jet lag, also known as circadian desynchrony. It is sleep disorder, which typically occurs when person travels across multiple time zones in a short period of time. At this case body's natural circadian rhythm mismatch to external environment. Jet lag manifests as daytime sleepiness, mood changes, gastrointestinal discomfort, psychomotor retardation, and insomnia. Generalized fatigue and malaise are common manifestations. During a normal circadian phase, dim light causes melatonin to increase approximately 2H before habitual sleep onset. This physiological response is known as dim light melatonin onset. Melatonin onset causes decreasing of core body temperature, alertness is also lowers. In the morning when light appear, melatonin level decreases, core body temperature increases, and alertness also increases. It causes wakefulness. Natural bright light is the most potent modifier of the circadian cycle. Jet lag is often mistaken for travel fatigue. The travel fatigue syndrome involves generalized fatigue, occasional headache, and mental weariness as a result of distorted sleep routine. This occurs due to stress of travel. Management. There's no specific treatment for jet lag. Medicines are not usually needed for jet lag. Jet lag often improves after a few days as your body clock adjusts to the new time zone. Light is the strongest stimulus for realigning a person's sleep wake light dark cycles. So get sunlight during daytime of new time zone is good stimulus to manage jet lag. It is recommended to seek bright light exposure in the evening after westbound journey and in the morning after eastbound journey. This may be useful when the individual has traversed as many as eight time zones of travel. Melatonin is effective to treat insomnia due to jet lag. 5 mg is effective and no major adverse effects. Another approach is to attempt the same sleep-wake-home routine upon arrival at the destination. But often not practical. Caffeine intake might combat jet lag-induced daytime sleepiness. In one study involving passengers traveling eastward, slow-release caffeine, 300 mg, enhanced alertness. But caffeine can exacerbate insomnia in some cases. Sedatives also can be used. For example, Zolpidem, 10 mg, for 3 to 4 nights after traveling more than 5 time zones. Significantly improved sleep time and quality. Such medications including hypnotics can have serious adverse effects, and can affect daily life, so they are not recommended unless prescribed by specialist.